right, man. We back with another one. You see the title. Unless I decide to change it. <laughs> but uh, don't forget to be human. And this is kind of a piggyback off of some stuff I was writing last night. And it's really just like for me and, you know, for whoever else is watching this video. But for me, like at the end of it all, I'm just a man, bro. I'm just I'm just a man. You're just a man or you're just a female, you know, whoever's watching this video. But what I mean by that is like aside from all the stuff that I talk about on my channel, you know what I'm saying? Um cuz I'm really more about, you know, positivity and you know, consciousness, awareness, you know, raising that in the way that I can, you know, the best way that I can, the only way that I can. But at the same time, it's like you can't be you can't be too righteous and you also can't be too wicked either, right? And the majority of life takes place in that that in between space. Like if this was righteous and this is wicked, you see this big space here in between. From my understanding, I realize that that's where the majority of life is taking place, and that is the space that we need to occupy and and just understand that this is for the most part what we experience from life you know what i'm saying i'm kind of i'm piecing this together as i go <laughs> but um it's it's like so like when you look at people that are super righteous all the time you know what i'm saying they they do certain things and then there's a lot of things that they don't do. You know what I'm saying? Like super righteous people, you know, they could be like really religious, really into the church and all that type of shit. Uh, you know, they don't smoke, they don't drink, you know, they don't they don't really go out, you know, stuff like that. And I'm not saying you got to do those things, but at the same time it's just like that's a part of life. It's it's, you know what I'm saying? It's it's things that you can do and things that you can learn from those things. Now, I'm not saying go out and start snorting coke and shit like that, but you know what I'm saying? You do you. <laughs> I ain't never snorted no coke, but you know, and then speaking of, if we go to the more wicked side, that's like really indulgent, you know what I'm saying? Like whether it be alcohol or weed or, you know, any other drugs or any any form of addiction, you know what I'm saying? Like that's like the two extremes. But if we really really sit down and think about it and be real and honest about it and be human about it we all have a combination of both i know i do you know what i'm saying i'm not even gonna sit here and act like i ain't got no fucking weed in here ain't no weed in here right now but i mean like i'm not gonna sit here and act like i didn't smoke that <laughs> i'm not gonna sit here and act like i didn't smoke last night i'm not gonna sit here and act like i didn't drink last night you know what i'm saying because i did both of those things but you know what i did this morning I got up and made sure I did me about 25 minutes of cardio. You know what I'm saying? So the reason why I brought that up is because as long as you have a balance and you understand moderation, I think that you don't have to worry about being too far on either side. You know what I'm saying? Because me, I, I can't eat clean all the time. I can't read every day and meditate every day and uh like I, I can't do all those even though they're all good for me i can't just do those things sometimes i need some junk food sometimes i need some sugar some some candy or something like that sometimes i need some not need sometimes i want you know what i'm saying some alcohol sometimes i want some weed you know what i'm saying like sometimes we just want those things and it's okay to want those things it doesn't make you a bad person it doesn't uh it doesn't make you less than or less righteous or whatever the fuck or it doesn't make you like it doesn't make you any of those negative things unless you want to identify with it but it's all part of it you know what i'm saying it's it's all part of the whole you like it's it's not about as human beings i've come to realize that we're not supposed to just pick a side you know what i'm saying i think we need to be able to look at the whole thing and be able to take 
what we can and learn. You know what I'm saying? I was watching a video about this this morning, and he was saying how, you know, life has a lot of highs and lows, but it's the space in between that's really what matters. It's, it's, it's the lessons in between. It's the time in between. It's the experiences that we get in between those two extremes. And that's where we, that's, that's what we occupy, man. And realistically, I think that, you know, I don't know what the fuck you believe, but, you know, they always talk about God and the devil, right? If God's up here and the devil's in hell under here, heaven's up here, hell's over here, this is where earth is, bro. That's where earth is. Earth is in the middle. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to just leave that at that. <laughs> but, um, yeah, I, I think uh, the main reason why I really wanted to make this video is because of just... I'm, I'm becoming more aware of what I'm doing and what I'm putting out into the world. And I'm proud of what I'm doing. I enjoy what I'm doing. But at the same time, I don't want to paint a picture like, and I don't think I come off this way, but I'm just, I'm just covering my tracks. You know what I'm saying? I don't want to come off like, oh, I'm better than everybody and I know more and I'm smarter. None of that shit. I got a job just like the rest of y'all. You know what I'm saying? I drive a 2007 Chrysler Sebring. This is a, people be thinking it's an old ass lady pulling up in my, in, when, when my car drive past. You know what I'm saying? I'm a regular ass dude. I'm making this video right before I go to work. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm, I'm, I'm just like all of y'all. I just, I'm in this, I'm in this same, meaning, I mean that in the way that I'm in this, I'm in this matrix just like y'all are. I'm in this society just like y'all are. I'm just, I'm in this world just like y'all are. You know what I'm saying? I just think the way that I think and you think the way that I think. And to some degree, the way that we think connects. And that's why we, uh, that's how we found each other. That's just the way I look at it, man. So, with all that being said, I'm sure that resonated with somebody. And, uh, yeah, leave me a comment, leave me a like, do whatever. Catch y'all on the next one, man. Y'all take it easy. Love y'all. Peace.